Hi, thank you for joining me today. We're reading through A Course in Miracles, The Daily Lessons, and today we're going to read Workbook Lesson 351. My sinless brother is my guide to peace. My sinful brother is my guide to pain, and which I choose to see, I will behold. Who is my brother but your holy son? And if I see him sinful, I proclaim myself a sinner, not a son of God, alone and friendless in a fearful world. Yet this perception is a choice I make and can relinquish. I can also see my brother sinless as your holy son. And with this choice, I see my sinlessness, my everlasting comforter and friend beside me and my way secure and clear. Choose then for me, my father, through your voice, for he alone gives judgment in your name. I'll read it again. This is lesson 351. My sinless brother is my guide to peace. My sinful brother is my guide to pain. And which I choose to see, I will behold. Who is my brother but your holy son? And if I see him sinful, I proclaim myself a sinner, not a son of God, alone and friendless in a fearful world. Yet this perception is a choice I make, and I can relinquish. I can also see my brother sinless as your holy son. And with this choice, I see my sinlessness, my everlasting comforter and friend beside me, and my way secure and clear. Choosing then for me, my father, through your voice, for he alone gives judgment in your name. It's a great lesson. And it really uh, just drives the point home, first of all, of what we perceive. So it's our judgments as we're looking around the world at each other and what we're doing and what other people are doing. It's our judgments that make them sinners or not. Because in God's eyes, no one is a sinner. The old teachings that so many religions have uh, shared, that God is vengeful, that God expects perfection out of us, that God expects anything out of us even, none of these are quite accurate. And if you, if you understand that Probably most religion was written as a way to control the people. That was the point. If you didn't need to control people, why would we have all of these different various religions telling us who and what we are and how to live? Somebody wanted to control us and it was other people, it wasn't God. So this lesson here is all about letting go of those things and realizing that we are one, that we are each God's choice to be here. So when you look at someone you don't like and you judge them, you're bringing pain to yourself. You're bringing separation to yourself. You are confusing yourself because it's not true that they're separate. And to judge them is to, is to create yourself into a, a separate place than they are. Love is what will bring us all together. So I hope you have a great day with this. If you'd like additional support, you can reach out to me, 907-351-3003. Talking or texting. Or texting is best. Um, also, um, you can message me through SoundCloud or YouTube or Facebook. And also my websites lindalamp.com and lindalamp.shop. Until tomorrow, namaste and much love.